Ah, uh, yes, folks, the count you have lost as you're here on the Cotswold Trail. May March in the heart of the central Cotswolds here. Ah, uh, yes, folks, the beautiful Slard Valley, and down there, the village of Slard. So this territory will forever be remembered as Laurie Lee's territory. I'm here with um, a gentleman, Rod, and his good lady here, folks, tell me a little bit about this part of the world. You you love this area, no doubt. Yeah, we do, and we've been here 50 years. The uh, Mainly because of Laurie Lee, the, the valley's been um, precious to everybody, and so <clears throat> housing estates and building has been difficult to do to protect the valley which 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 is good in a way because we all we all love it and the slad brook runs along the bottom and uh we live in a house which is built over the over the brook and um i went to laurie lee's 80th birthday party and uh the saying was he never let a good story get in the way of the truth <laughs> Absolutely, but, but his writing was superb, and of course, sided with Rosie. There's nothing better in uh, in literature than the descriptive writing in sided with Rosie. Absolutely, and, uh, he was very eloquent, though he's very entertaining. Even even at that age, he was he would uh, come out with things that you'd uh, you'd think, God, that's uh, quite profound, you know. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you, always had a, you always had a good term. All, all good writers do. Yeah, that's right. But I think he wanted to be a poet, didn't he? He, he did, he did indeed. I think he, he courted the London scene to be a, to be a poet, but uh, ended up by sort of almost by accident coming back and writing the book that made his name. Absolutely. But yeah, no, he was very entertaining. <laughs> Rod, thank you so much. Pleasure. God bless. Well done. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, a beautiful part of the world here, folks. Um, the county of Gloucestershire. And the magnificent Cotswold Hills.